hundreds of Central American migrants have uh, gathered at the border bridge between Mexico and Guatemala as they seek passage north towards the United States. This in spite of United States President Donald Trump's threats of retaliation. Men, women and children waited onto a bridge connecting Mexico and Guatemala only to be met by dozens of Mexican police and immigration officials on the other side of the gate. Many have vowed to stay put, demanding to be let through, but only a small number have trickled in. Many of these migrant families are fleeing violence and poverty back home with large waves of Central America afflicted by gang violence and drug trafficking. Earlier, U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo met Mexican President Enrique Pena, Pena Nieto to discuss the uh, migrant situation. On Thursday, Trump threatened to deploy the military and close the southern U.S. border if Mexico did not halt the new stream of migrants. I just wanted to give you a little bit of a readout on my uh, meeting with President Peña Nieto. Um, it was a good conversation. We are jointly very focused on the caravan that is making its way through. Uh, the Mexican government is making all the decisions about how to address this, and they are fully engaged. They sent 500 that are allies down to the southern border. I wanted to express my sympathy to them. Um, they've had four policemen injured already. putting women and children in front of the caravan to use as shields as they make their way through. Seguimos la marcha. Nosotros no los quitamos de aquí mientras no los dejen pasar a todos, porque nosotros queremos 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 pasar todos. Los hombres y las mujeres, ¿por qué nosotros los quieren llevar? ¿Por qué nosotros los quieren pasar? Y que que con mentiras. Y nosotros no creemos, no creemos en eso, en eso que ellos están diciendo, porque no lo creemos. Nosotros queremos salir adelante trabajando porque somos personas honestas, personas honradas.